Lujic with an opportunity. Rare opportunity in his career now to be and, a, an individual European champion. And that's the key way to look at it, because, of course, psychologically, he's already won race down. He's up against the world champion, the fastest qualifier in the rainbow stripes. It'd be very easy to come into this heat already feeling defeated. But like you say, Roger needs to see it as an opportunity. He could potentially take Lavraisen to three rides. He could potentially beat Lavraisen. We know Lavraisen is beatable. He was beat at the Track Champions League, which I don't think many people expected to see. So if Ridgick has that belief, races at his own race, could have an exciting finale ahead of us. Lavresen having to lead this one out. As you said, not unbeatable in the last 12 months or so. Has the individual title getting the better of Matthew Richardson. He knows the Australian is there, breathing down his neck, and he will be in Jakarta in a couple of weeks' time. Here at the Euros, Rujic starts to up the speed. Swings left and right, can he use his own experience? But he still needs to have the legs. One and a half laps to the conclusion of this second in the best of three event in the finale for the European title. The bell rings, it's time to go, it's time to sprint. Rudjik is doing just that, gets close. They switch left, switch light. And it's Lavresen who's still in front. Rudjik trying to make the effort to get on level terms, but he's struggling. He's not going to do it unless there's a huge human effort in the final straight. And Harry Lavresen yet again is the European champion. And there was only really one rider in it. You're right, Rob. Lavresen once again looking super dominant there. Fair play to Rudjik, but never looked in doubt whatsoever for Lavresen. World champion, now European champion. Job done very well at these European champs so far for him. Didn't compete in this competition in Munich, but he has the title back from 2021 that he won then. In total, it's European title number eight for him. And the 25-year-old from the Netherlands is victorious again. So Harry Lavresen has it again. All smiles and another victory salute from the Dutchman. Well, he's quite the list of titles now, Harry Lavresen. Of all those achievable, he's only really missing the Kieran Olympic title already.